everyone. My name is Sarika Vijayaraman and I am 10 years old. Today, I like to tell you a story tomorrow and day. The title of my story is The Clever Mind. Once upon a time, the big character, Clever, was little man. Correct was the elder. But Yuba was the youngest. Daily feathers got lots of bread, fruit, nuts, and cheese to the castle. I am the oldest, so I will get the biggest pay. Clap red. James and Mia came next. I never get anything. Wait, Yuba. One day. No feather came. The mice were worried. They were worried that they might die from hunger. A big dragon are blocking their path. Credits are not able to make their way up to save their friend squirrel. Borek said, Oh dear, what shall we do? We have to find a way out. No one replied. Aha! I have an idea. But if it's successful, you must promise me that you will always divide the food equally. All of them agreed. The mice collected many jars of jam, chocolate, candy, and marshmallows. They took them to the dragon's cave. Dragon ate all food that was given. Then he ate a terrible scarf egg, crunched his stomach and roared. Oh, help me! I am dying! What is happening to me? The mice were hiding nearby. No more shouted from the fire. If you go to the mountain, you will never have a stomach ache ever again. Quick! Move now! The dragon leaped them and went away without saying a word. The feathers began coming again. The mice were very happy. The moral of the story is you have to be creative to find solutions to your problems and do not be lazy. Thank you for listening.